So how do you open a workbook automatically when Excel 2013 starts? Here I have book one and I change the column width as well as the row heights. I like it big so I can see these cells very clearly. So what I did here is I saved this file to my desktop and then I drag it into, into this folder. Now the reason why I actually saved it first to my desktop is because I don't have the administrative privileges to save to this folder directly. This C program files, Microsoft Office, Office 15, Excel start folder. So I'm going to copy this and show you where the, these files are. So I'm going to click up here and here I dragged it in from my desktop and I have book one and I have book two. I saved a separate file also blank with large cells. Let's see what happens when I close Excel and I open up Excel again. So here I am opening Excel and pam pam right away all the all the workbooks inside my X Excel start folder are opened automatically. I have book one and book two. This is great because I can jump straight to get straight to work without even seeing the start screen. Now for security reasons, you probably should leave this folder alone, but if you really want to be able to save it directly, file save as right into this folder, let me show you the trick. So here's my Office 15 folder. And here is my Excel start folder. I'm gonna right click, go to properties, and go to security, and look for users. Here's users. Right now the full control and modify is not allowed. So we go to edit, and then we go to users. I'm using Windows 7 by the way. And we can set full control modify, well full control which checks everything automatically. And this should now allow you to save as straight to that folder. So remember that you can use the Excel start folder in your office installation to open a workbook automatically.